Hi everyone, welcome to our channel. In this video, I am going to explain the bones in the human skeleton, their names and uses. First one is the skull, whereas in the neck there will be neck bones called cervical vertebrae and in the shoulder region there will be a bone called clavicle which is also called as collar bone and the scapula which is also called as shoulder blades and in the thoracic region there will be ribs there will be 12 pairs of ribs and there will be a bo middle bone called sternum which supports the ribs and in the back side there will be a vertebral column coming to the hands the bones above the elbow there is one bone called humerus and below the elbow there are two bones which is called as radius as well as the ulna and in the hand there will be wrist bones which are called as carpals. In the hands, there will be hand bones which are called as metacarpals. And in the finger regions, there are finger bones which are called as phalanges. And in the pelvis region, there will be ilium, ischium, pubis bones will be seen. Coming to the legs, the bones which are above the knee, there is called a bone called femur. There is one bone. And below the knees, there are two bones. And in the knees, there is a bone called patella, which is a knee cap. And below the knee, there will be two bones, which is called as tibia and fibula. And in the ankle region, there will be ankle bones called tarsals. In the feet, there is foot bones called metatarsals. And in the toes, there are two bones called phalanges. There are many uses of uh, bones. There are approximately 206 bones are seen in the human body. And it has so many functions like in the skull, there is a brain which protects the internal organs. And in the sternum and the ribs, a rib cage which protects the heart as well as the lungs. The pelvis region supports the kidneys, uterus and reproductive organs. Along with the protection of internal organs, it also helps in various movements like radius, ulna, humerus, tibia, fibula which are hand and leg bones which helps in the movement. Along with this, the bone has some bone marrow which helps in the production of red blood cells and it helps in the storage of minerals like calcium, phosphorus etc. This is all about the bones in the human skeleton and their uses hope you like the video if you like the video please share and subscribe our channel thank you